Welcome to our lecture online and now we're going to see an example where we cannot multiply two matrices together because they are the wrong size combination. So again the rule is that you have two matrices, one matrix C that has dimensions m by n, so n number rows, n number columns. Matrix D has dimensions p times q which means, which means p number rows and q number columns. We can see there in order to be able to multiply the two matrices the number of columns of the first matrix must equal the number of rows of the second matrix. If they're not equal, you cannot multiply the two matrices. The size of the product matrix will, will be equal to the number of rows of the first matrix times the number of columns of the second matrix. So here we have two matrices, matrix A and B. Matrix A has three rows and one column, so this is a three by one matrix. Matrix B has two rows and three columns, so this is a two by three matrix. So when we compare the number of columns of the first matrix to the number of rows of the second matrix, those, that number is not equal. And since that's not equal, you cannot multiply the two matrices. If you could, of course, the resulting size would be 3 by 3, by three but it's not even possible. We cannot even begin because the number, of, the number of columns of the first matrix does not equal the number of rows of the second matrix. So in that case, you cannot do the multiplication. That's as far as you can go. And that's how we know.